Welcome to Armenia. So now I am in Armenia. Look at that. It's beautiful over here in Armenia. We have a good weather today and we're going to visit the church. Let's go. So I am guys. Uh, okay, so we're going to discover the metal roof. Because that church has like a cross inside when you look from above. Okay. Oh, I love this. Armenia. For a brief period from 1918 to 1920, Armenia became an independent republic. In late 1920, local communists came to power following an invasion of the Armenian by the Soviet Red Army. And in 1922, Armenia became part of the Transcaucasian Soviet Socialist Republic. Western Armenia fell under the domination of Ottoman Turkey in 1555 under the Treaty of Ar Amasya signed with Persia and Eastern Armenia became Russia's territory in 1826-28. to 28. According to the Treaty of Turkmenchai signed as a result of the Russo-Persian War. Where did the original Armenians come from? The view that Armenians are native to the South Caucasus is supported by ancient Armenian historical accounts and legends, which place the Ararat plain as the cradle of Armenian culture as well as modern genetic research. You feel like it's already a church, but like entrance. Okay. And when they have big congregation, of course, they use all the territory. But technically, there is a Gabi and then a church. Build. Yeah, it's difficult to enter. You, you saw the road. Yeah, the it's road's wide. too narrow. Yeah, just for the small, uh, the small car. So they protected the main entrance because this is the only way. They the Greek Bible, which is in Genesis, simply represented Ararat by a transliteration. In this instance, translate. Hebrew land of Ararat with Armenia. Of course, the translation of Genesis and Isaiah were not made by the same individual, but the Greek of the Pentateuch did have a great influence in subsequent. Did Ar Armenia belong to Persia? For 12 more centuries, Armenia was under the direct or indirect rule of the Persians. What is now modern day, Armenia was relatively recently separated from Iran by the Russian victory in the Russo Persian War, 1826 to 1828. What race are the Armenians closest to? Armenians were found to have genetic affinity to several other populations, including the Jewish, Druze, and Lebanese Christians. In addition to showing genetic continuity with the Caucasus. Ayan guys, we visited two monasteries, the, the monastery of Sanahin, the Church of Redeemer, and then the monastery of Church of Hagvat Monastery, Ulala. Monastery of Hagvat, Church of Holy Sign. Ayan. Sila pala ang unang religious Catholic doon sa Armenia. Hagpat Monastery, also known as the Hagpatabank, is a medieval monastery complex in Hagpat, Armenia. Significance UNESCO World Heritage Site, described as a masterpiece of religious architecture, and a major center of learning in the Middle Ages. Hagpat Monastery together with Sanahin Monastery was placed on UNESCO's World Heritage List in 1996. The monasteries at Hagpat and Sanahin were chosen as UNESCO World Heritage Sites because the two monastic conflicts represent the highest flowering of Armenian religious. Architecture whose unique style developed from a blending of elements by Byzantine ecclesiastical architecture and the traditional vernacular architecture of the Caucasian region. 
Dito guys sa Armenia, marami ditong mga Catholic churches. Dito mga 13th century, ganun. At saka before Christ pa. Imagine, hindi ko ma-imagine Armenia, mayroon pala silang mga Catholic churches, monastery, ang dami-dami. Next naman, ito yung lahat ng floor. Ayan yun, you know, graveyard yan, yung cementerio. Yan, flat-flat. Wala, wala naman nakalagay na cross. Mayroon cross naman pa isa-isa. Ayan yung cementerio. Ayan, sa likod ng simbahan. At saka sa loob, yung lahat ng flooring ng simbahan yan ay puro tao pala. Ayan, inilibing. Ayan, guys. Mga graveyard yan dyan. Flat. Flat yung flooring nila. Kakatakot. At saka dito, guys, sa Armenia, malapit sila sa border ng Russia. At saka, uh, Tiran, Iran, ayan. Tsaka Russia, ayan. Tapos Georgia. At saka Turkey, malapit din sila. So, ayan guys, yung flooring. Ayan, graveyard yan guys. Ayan. The history of Armenia covers the topics related to the history of the Republic of Armenia as well as the Armenian people, the Armenian language, and the regions of Eurasia historically and geographically considered Armenian. Armenia is located between eastern Anatolia and the Armenian highlands surrounding the biblical mountains of Ararat. The endonym of the Armenian is Hay, and the old Armenian name for the country is Haik. Armenian, which also means Armenians in classical Armenian. Later, Hayasta. Armenian traditionally associate this name with the legendary progenitor of the Armenian people, Haik. The name Armenia and Armenian are exonames, first attested in the Behistun inscription. Of Darius the Great, the early Armenian historian Mubs Kurinatsi derived the name Armenia from Aramanak, the eldest son of the legendary Haik. Various theories exist about the origin of the Indo name and Exo names of Armenia and Armenians. The Bronze Age, several states flourished in the Armenian highlands, including the Hittite Empire. Mitani, the southwestern sister of Armenian, and Hayasa Azi. Soon after the Hayasa Azi were the Nairi Tribal Confederation and the Kingdom of Urartu. My God, 1600 BC. Each of the aforementioned nations and tribes participated in the endogenous of the Armenian people. Naku guys, hindi natin maalala ang mga pangalan na yan eh, na nakadescribe dito sa kanila. Prehistory. Stone tools from 325,000 years ago had been found in Armenia, which indicate the presence of early humans at this time. Wow. In the 1960 excavation in the Yerevan, one cave uncovered evidence of ancient human habitation, including the remains of 48,000 year old heart and a human cranial fragment and tooth of the similar age. The Armenian highland shows traces of settlement from the Neolithic era. Archaeological surveys in 2010 and 2011 have resulted in the discovery of the world's earliest known leather shoe, 3500 BC, a skirt, 3900 BC, and wine-making facility, 4000 BC at the Arena 1 cave complex. 
My God, ang uh, tagal na pala ng Armenian history. May mga turista din na chikwa. Yan, dami nila. Isang bus. Ay, dalawang bus pala yan. So, ayan guys. Itong uh, history ng Armenia ay napakahaba at napaka-interesting. Interesting talaga. Yan o, oh, yung mountains na yan. Sa likod niyan, Russia na at saka Iran, Tiran, yan. Early 20th century scholars suggested that the name Armenia may have possibly been recorded for the first time on an inscription which mentioned Armani or Armanum together with Ibla from territories conquered by Naram Sin 2300 BC Imagine before Christ identified with an Akkadian colony in the current region of Jarbikir However, the precise location of both Armani and Ibla are unclear. Some modern research have placed Armani army in the general area of modern Samsat and have suggested it was populated at least partially by an early Indo-European speaking people. Today, the modern Assyrians who traditionally speak Neo-Aramaic, not Akkadian, refer to the Armenians by the name Armani. It is possible that the name Armenia originates in the Arma Armeni, Urartian, or inhabitant of Ar Army, or Armian country. The Army tribe of Urartian texts may have been the Oromo, who in the 12th century BC attempted to invade Assyria from the north and their allies, allies and the Mosque and the Kaskians. My God, ang haba ng istorya na to, ah. <laughs> Before Christ pa, grabe. At saka Catholic sila, girls, guys, no? Catholic sila rito. At saka yung simbahan nila, napaka, ano, napakadami. Sa pinuntahan namin mga monasteryo, lahat ng flooring ng simbahan na to ay mga graveyard. Diyan nililibing yung mga tao, sabi sa amin ng guide. Yan, tapos uh, pag nagmimisa, nilalagyan lang nila ng carpet. Yan, o, puro graveyard yan, yung flooring ng simbahan na yan. Grabe. Bala guys, hanggang dito na lamang yung ating istorya dito sa Armenia detour natin at see you on my next travel video ciao ciao